Hello guys, welcome back. Uh, today we're doing a how to become a moderator in Colobus. Today I'm joined with uh, I'm Louis. Uh, he is a trial mod right now, and we're Hello. going to be telling you guys how you have a better chance to become a moderator and yeah, have a fire axe or work your way up all the way to the band hammer. So let's go. So first of all, um, when you join the game, say you're new, uh, you won't be able to burn events because you're not moderator, obviously. But to become a moderator, mm -hmm. uh, what you can do is you can join the Discord. Uh, it's di discord.gg slash Colobus. And you, make once sure you join you that, over. Yeah, you have to be in the server for two days. So make sure you're in it for at least two days. Uh, you have to be 13 or over. Um, if you're under, we, we will know because we'll have the voice thing. And if you sound a lot younger, you'll say that you can't be in the team and you your trial will be revoked from you so next up once you're in the discord uh you you have to stay in there for two days like i said but what you do have to do is you have to wait until uh things like mod apps come out as you can see on screen right now uh that's the channel you need to go in when they come out It'll be an announcement, sort of topic. Well, it'll be in both, I think. But um, you just have to fill those out, how how much you'll be active. And when they come out, one someone will be picked to be a moderator, like that. We pick normally, how much is it? Every like month, we pick three people. Uh, and I think it's going to be a bit longer this time. Yeah, because we have quite a few. But, um, yeah, I think we're ma on max at the moment. Yeah. Plus, being a moderator uh, has a big responsibility of you being active, helping the community and not being toxic towards anyone, really. And even if someone's uh, being s stupid, swearing, uh, etc., hacking, whatever they're doing, uh, glitching. Yeah, glitching, you're still keeping a calm manner towards them and not screaming at them to stop just report them because there is a report system so in the vents yeah in the vents i'll show you now it's pretty easy once you report someone it'll, the second you report them they'll be sent to a message in discord which therefore oh, any it. yeah any co-owners or whoever <laughs> has access to playfab um will be able to ban them very soon after they uh you report them so I'll show you the report system now. Hurry up, Jay, you're so slow. Because I'm laggy. Remember, you're just slow. Alright. Hey, Jay, I think I might report you, you know? So this is the report system. Uh, there is up to 20 players every single lobby, and there's only one lobby unless you join the public. Normally, to the wards of end UK time, around 7 o'clock um, American time, that's when the servers are like up to here full, maybe in the full. What you do is you press the number, say, so first of all, you have to find the name. Find the number, you have to press the number. So say, I'm Louis. I know he wouldn't, but say he was being toxic, I'll go one, press one, and then here we have three options, toxic, hate speech, or cheating. Um, I'm not going to do it right now because he hasn't done nothing, but that's what I, I normally... You could do it and then put it on the Discord saying there is a problem. Yeah, I'll show you a message of what pops up. That's what pops yeah, up true. when you do it, uh, and it does it automatically. If you are interested in doing moderating for a while, you have to give up, like, you have to be on for quite a while just moderating the server. So if you don't feel like you have enough responsibility to do that, uh, I don't think it's worth you joining up. Uh, another thing is you're not allowed to play the game just because you're a moderator. Most people join only just to be moderator. But I am Louie here. He's been playing the game. I don't think he even knew he... What, I don't think he even wanted to be a moderator. Now, of course he wanted to, but he he never said, can I be a moderator? He, he kind of just waited, and then... Because he just played the game, and he thought it was really fun. He got a chance to be a moderator, and now he's on trial mods. So... I kind of just didn't stop playing the game, Jesus Christ. 
Yeah, yeah anything can really happen. Um, but yeah. Do you have any uh, uh, other things to say, Louis? Um, make sure you become active, like you're very active on the Discord. You need to become trusted by someone. Well, you don't have to be, but it will give you like, yeah. a bit more. So say you want to become a community manager, you it will take you quite a while. What the hell? You lost track in for a second. Uh, you'll have to go from trial mod to moderator. Then it's admin and then head admin. Or is it head administrator? I think it's head administrator. Then co-owner. Then, uh, yeah, I'm not really sure. But the more you work up, the better the world you have. Right? Yeah. So the more you work your way up, the better the way, or the better the roles you get. So when you work really high up and you're trusted by most people, you will be able to be able to ban people through Playfab and have Playfab access. But that takes quite a while to get, and you have to be like a really good, kind of strict um, moderator at the start, like make sure you're reporting people properly and do it like everything that you're meant to but anyway guys uh that might wrap up today's video uh thank you for louis to helping me and that is how you become a moderator or tips to become a moderator anyway it's been jay and yes bye